Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the best sports talk radio show around. We love Clayton. Here we talk about NFL predictions, the NBA Finals, and the upcoming MLB All-Star Game and Home Run Derby. So feel free to call at any time. Our number is 733-CLAYTON. That is 733-C-L-A-Y-T-O-N. All right, so let's start off. NFL predictions. Who do we think is going to make, who's going who's gonna to go the distance? Matt? Uh, well, I think that the San Francisco 49ers are going to go the distance this year because all the free agent splashes that they've made this year and from their talent last year that they've had, and they really showed that they could make it to the Super Bowl and have an effect on the league. So with the Ravens, that was a great game. They almost won it, and the Ravens have lost a lot of players. They lost Ray Lewis to retirement and Ed Reed to the Texans. So they're probably not going to be as good this year, especially with Flacco's contract. So I think the 49ers are going to take it this year with all their defensive talent, especially on the defensive line, and with everything they have. And the Ravens also sent a lot of their players over the San Francisco 49ers, so it's almost like giving up their spot. I, Simon? I also agree with that because I think San Francisco 49ers were a really smart team. It's just that they run into some bad luck and some uh, questionable calls by some referees. But they played a really good game with the Baltimore Ravens this past Super Bowl, so I really think the San Francisco 49ers can, can go the distance this year. All right, we have a caller right now, so let's uh, bring him in. Hey. All right. Hi, caller. Hello, my name is Chuck. Do you think any team will move to L.A. in the next five years? And if so, what team? Uh, I do think so, that there could possibly be an NFL team in the city of Los Angeles. I think it either could be between the Jacksonville Jaguars or the Oakland Raiders. I say the Raiders because it, Oakland is a city that has been talked about moving different teams all around California for the past maybe three seasons in all different sports. And I say the Jacksonville Jaguars because, let's just be real, they kind of suck. So they might, they might want to move soon. I think, like what you said, the Raiders is a good point because they, they kind of, they're a build, they're like an up-and-coming team. They have a lot of pieces, like they have Darren McFadden and you know, a bunch of other pieces around him. So I think like they'll want to end up developing some popularity and moving to a big city like L.A. I think yeah. that's going to help them be able to become more popular. The right? big market would be good. Yeah. I yeah. think it could happen, but not in the next few years, only because it just seems like They've always been talking about it, and there's just been no evidence that shows, oh, they're just going to go all of a sudden now. Because I've never, they've been saying, oh, they might move this year, this year, this year. They've been kept saying that. So I just don't see why they would move if they haven't done it yet. So it might take a little while to get some more reasoning to do it. So I just don't think they will right now. Good point. Charlie, what do you think? I don't think any team will move to L.A. because I, last I remember there was some kind of tax that was required moving there for the new stadium and leaving their old stadium and having to buy out. And it just seems too messy for any team to want to move. Well, that's not about moving, but the Miami Marlins did that in baseball. They built a whole new stadium, 75% off of taxpayers' dollars. So the state was paying, the state of Florida and the city of Miami was paying for over half of what the stadium cost was. Not the Marlins, because the Marlins have no money, because they, they're horrible. Um, all the players away. Yeah, so the Raiders, if they were to move to the city of Los Angeles, they would pretty much, they could probably do the same thing and ask for taxpayer dollars from both cities to help fund a new stadium. What do you guys think about the Clayton Football League? Oh, it's my, kickball league. it's my favorite pastime. I really don't think baseball should be the national sport yeah. anymore. Well, they are our sponsor, the Clayton Kickball League. Coming up, they have the Clayton Ostrich Bowl, where they will have a big kickball tournament. So we have to go. We'll take a little break. So come back on We Love Clayton, Clayton Radio. See you around.